right, well, happy Super Bowl Sunday. We thought it was a great opportunity for us to come on out to check out everything new at Universal Studios since we really don't have a stake in this game. <laughs> we don't, but good luck to your team. Yeah, so we're hoping the crowds are gonna be a little less, so we're hopefully gonna show you the parade and a lot of the Mardi Gras offerings uh, along with everything else new. So first starter off is we found some cool bags. Oh yeah, we'll show them right here, but give us a thumbs up and subscribe and let's see if we can find some food and drink. We're a little hungry. So first spotting that we found here at Universal is they got the clock tower on a bag and then they got these nice little handbags that have the little time dates on it. So 88 miles an hour. That's pretty cool. So that's pretty cool lounge fly. Yeah. $82. Ooh, and they may even have a Ghostbusters one, yeah. Okay, there's a Ghostbusters lounge fly. I've never seen that before. Uh -uh. Huh, so that's cool. Our first sighting of an Olympic sign, Paris 2024. Who's excited? And their summer games. I'm definitely ready for some Olympics. So we have seen a fair amount of people exiting the park. Uh, like we just passed by a huge crowd. So this is a way for a light park to go on Super Bowl Sunday, sign us up. And also let us know a lot are leaving with Voodoo Donuts. We've never had one. Let us know, <laughs> is it something we should be getting and not missing out? <laughs> we have some very tall people right here. And once again, just like Christmas, we're starting the parade before it happens. Hey, we have some Zoidbergs or lobsters. I have no she idea. Hi, happy Mardi Gras. Hi, Hi, how are happy you? Happy Mardi Gras. <laughs> I don't know how she's doing that, but I guess she has a strong core. How are you squatting on those? Whew. Hello, kitty. All right, Mardi Gras signs everywhere. We'll try to see if we can find some snacks. Canada candied bacon and onion poutine. That looks like something. Let us know if you've tried this. We're on the fence. Yeah, and neither one of us are big on Fireball, so oh, not yes. sure about the Fireball cinnamon whiskey. But let us know if you would buy that. It looks good. So at the Coca-Cola Market Square, we picked up. My pick was an orange whoopie pie. Oh yeah, that looks good. And then the potato on a spiral thing with parmesan and then also season salt. Season salt. So we'll give these a go. We'll let you know. They look good. Okay, so our, the potato thing was so-so. It wasn't really super done. It was okay. This, though, is really good. Yeah. It's probably the star. Yeah, so I have to agree with the potato. If it wasn't for the salt, there really wouldn't be any flavor, but the whoopie pie. I would give that a go. We should have maybe each got one. They're that good. <laughs> okay, we may be trying this too. Mexico, the chilaquiles. We've had that at Epcot for the first time, very good. And maybe margarita. Oh, churro loops. Okay, so these chilaquiles are very awesome tasting. It's just, I wish it were more, because they show like a plate, you know, which looks like a lot. And there's not a whole lot in there, but we are sharing it. Yeah, so Maybe. I think it was, how much was it? Uh, $7.50, $7.50. Yeah, so um, I don't know if it's worth the price for the amount that you get, but, but it, tastes it tastes good. delicious, yeah. All right, churros have been obtained, and it looks like there's four, so they're rings. So we each get two. The chocolate sauce, it's really good. But yeah. they're like two bucks a piece. But yeah, so these are, not bad. they are really good and they came out hot because they're freshly made. But it would have been nice to have a little bit more cinnamon and sugar. And these are $7.99, so. Yeah, mine might be totally missing the sugar and cinnamon, but they're very hot and this chocolate sauce is really good.
just finished our first ever Mardi Gras parade at Universal. And somehow we came away with all of our limbs and we do have a couple beads, but <laughs> I don't know if I need to ever experience that again. We didn't get hit with any, but it's, <laughs> people take the people beard as the beard. People are extremely competitive and sometimes downright rude, so. They take their beads I'm done. very seriously. <laughs> Okay, one last food item, chicken schnitzel, if that's coming out in the dark. Uh, oh boy, almost lost it. Caveman style. That's good, it's really good. It's almost like horseradish mustard. And to wash it down, there you go. we have two butter beers. Butter beer. So it said chicken thigh, but that looks like that looks like white meat to me. So, I don't know. So, would you recommend it? I would. Yeah, best thing probably today. Very good. And this is at the beer garden, uh, so Germany booth here. It's good. I should have got a beer though, but I'm fine. All right, so with everybody else, we are heading out of the park. So, hope you enjoyed our little time here at Universal Studios. Give us a thumbs up, like our, our subscribe to our channel. Just quick little visit to Universal. Yep, so let us know if you make it down here around Mardi Gras time. All right, see you in the next one.